Hi guys, and welcome to a new video. Hello. So we thought we would vlog today and tomorrow because we've got an exciting few days. So today we have traveled to Watford and we're currently at the Into Watford, the shopping center. Uh -huh. And then we're staying overnight in a hotel because tomorrow we are off to Harry Potter Studios. <laughs> If you watch our vlogs, if you watch our vlogs last year, you'll know that this is quite like an annual trip for us. It I've is. been to Harry Potter Studios. This will be my fourth time, I think, and that this will be your third. Third time, yeah. And we always go around Christmas time so we can see Hogwarts in the snow. No, we didn't last year. No, we, we went at Halloween, didn't yeah. we? But we're super excited. But we've come to Watford early. We've come a day before, um, so that we can have a nice stay in a hotel, a little bit of a treat for us. Best Western. And we've, um, as I said, we're at the Into Watford Shopping Centre, and we're going to have a little spy and Primark, aren't we? We are for a few goodies. We so are. yeah, we thought we'd vlog. I hope you enjoy, and let's go. So little Martin Bell there is desperate for the loo. <laughs> He's running, you running away from me. <laughs> the hunt for the loo. This place looks huge. Have oh, you found one? So I've got a map, and we're just deciding where to eat. I've just come having a little look at Ed's diner. We've never eaten here before. Like an American diner. So we decided on Ed's diner. <laughs> Look who I'm having lunch with, the goof. <laughs> He's always here. <laughs> Ooh, look at this. You happy? <laughs> so we've just eaten a full meal, but Martin can't help himself. What have you found? Just made in the, made in the USA. Gobstone nerds. There's also Harry Bull selection. Mm. But look at that. Boxes, Skittles, all the different flavours. Oh, it's got the sour, tropical, tropical sour, fruit, yeah, wild oh, berry, yeah, yeah. And Brussels sprout sweets. <laughs> we found the mothership. <laughs> Yay! Twenty percent off this week only. Oh, is it? In store online. Hashtag gift magic. Dangerous for the new film. Let's go fly a kite. That's so cute. Emily Blunt there, she's got her own figure. Oh, that's nice. I like that. It's better than the Emma Watson one. <laughs> oh. The mug. Diary. Practically perfect in every way. 9.99. We haven't found Winnie, but we found Eeyore in his Christmas gear. That's so cute. It's a goof. Oh, he's hitting him. <laughs> oh, that's so cute. Oh, that's nice. <laughs> Look at these. So it's designed like the VHS, which we remember. <laughs> and then you open it, the front page, there's the tape, and then it's a notebook. But they've got Lion King, Hercules. Beauty and the Beast, Hercules. I think they've got Goofy movie merch. That's so rare. Yeah. And then on the back, it's got the description, the synopsis that you'd find on the back of the video tape. These are just so cool. You're tempted, aren't you? I'm very tempted. Ten pound. I am not fast. <laughs> la 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 la. la. <laughs> all these pops here, and they're all Moana. And then you've just got Snow White. It's quite a cool one. This is the old game operation, but it's Chewbacca. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that'd be great. So every time you make a mistake, you'd go, <laughs> We found the Primark. We're on the hunt for Harry Potter jumpers, Christmas pajamas. It's a goofy onesie. Maybe this is what you have to wear on Christmas Day. <laughs> His head's really small. Oh, <laughs> I can be goofy. <laughs> hey guys, so it's a bit later. That wasn't very successful, was it? It wasn't a successful trip, no. <laughs> we had a long list of stuff that we wanted to get. We couldn't 
find any of it. Uh, we did pick up a couple of bits though, so I will show them to you when we <laughs> reach the hotel. A couple, being <laughs> You're laughing because it literally race. is too. <laughs> but yeah, we didn't manage to find any Harry Potter jumpers that we liked in Primark. And we didn't find any matching Christmas pyjamas which we wanted. So we're still on the hunt for those. We're hoping that we might be able, because we're not at the studios till three tomorrow, so we're hoping that we'll be able to find another Primark or another <laughs> Harry Potter shop before. Um, but if not, it doesn't matter. Round and round and round we go. <laughs> <laughs> when will it stop? No one will. These roundy like um, X's to shopping centres remind me of when we were little. When I was little and I used to be like, ooh, like a roller coaster. So we're just on the way to the hotel we're staying at now. It's the Best Western and I think it's about a 20 minute drive from the studios. arrived and we're heading to the reception. I saw a sneak peek as we went by and it looks so Christmassy. There's like Christmas, Christmas lights and Christmas trees. Yeah. Well you think it looks richly nice what we paid. <laughs> there it is guys. It looks like a Christmassy Hogwarts. <laughs> Weddings. Aww. Is that the guy? That is so Christmassy. Off he goes. His first day at Hogwarts. <laughs> so we just checked in, they were really friendly, really nice, and we've been upgraded. So yeah, the room might be a little bit nicer than the one we actually booked. One, two, two. Uh, we are, we're building. one, one, two. One, one, two. We found it. <laughs> yes. Oh, it's quite big. Oh, it's very, very Ooh, snazzy. <laughs> Oh my gosh, it's huge! Oh, that TV just came on. Okay, well, it's easy for the car in. That was really creepy. <laughs> this is huge! So guys, I don't think we actually booked a room this big. Um, I think they're obviously quiet because it's a Monday night. So, although, I thought they might be quite busy during the week. They had lots of like corporate people staying. But yeah, we've been upgraded, so it is huge! I will show you around. Oh look, my smart and gone. Nice little garden. That's nice. <laughs> if it was summer, you could sit down and eat breakfast out here. Yeah. Yeah, that's cool, isn't it? It's massive. But yeah, so this is when you come back in from outside. So you've got uh, two seats here, a table, huge sofa. I mean, the decor is very snazzy. <laughs> Um, you've got a huge bed, that is huge. You've got lights, some more snazzy decor, look up here. Very snazzy. Uh, you've got a lovely TV, a desk, big mirror. Got to do the wave. <laughs> you've always got to do the wave. Oh, well, Martin, what are you doing? Oh, you wondered if there'd be tea and coffee. And little biscuits. Can you tell we don't stay in hotels that much? <laughs> we, do. we do actually. Look at how luminous the to be fair, is. we do stay. Oh, nice. We do stay in hotels, um, obviously on holiday and stuff. But there's something really luxurious about staying in a hotel in England, like overnight. We just thought we'd make two days out of our trip to Harry Potter, and I'm so glad we did now because yeah, the room we paid sixty-three pounds for the room overnight. The whole room, not each. So I think for £63, it's really nice. Tea station, fridge. Glotini fridge. A bean. <laughs> Glotini fridge. Uh, this is like a little seating area. Seating? It's isn't for it? shoes, isn't it? Oh, is Why it? Why would you sit here? <laughs> Why is everyone's over there on the sofa? <laughs> for shoes. Shoes and bags. 
<laughs> and then you've got huge, oh, you've got an iron, a safe. I think this would be a bag, actually. Suitcase. Huge wardrobe. There, that, and then the bathroom, it's so <laughs> glittery. Oh, you know, we said we were gonna get a lush bath bomb. Yeah. Oh. We, we wondered if there'd be a bath, um, because we passed Lush and we were like, oh, we should get Lush bath bombs. So then we can like both have a bath. But yeah, we weren't sure whether the hotel would have a bath, but it does, but we didn't get, I think I've brought some bath stuff, but I don't think I've brought like bubble bath stuff. But yeah. Oh my gosh, it's a um, waterfall shower. I love them. And then yeah, it's lovely. Really clean, really bright. No, this is really nice. Yeah, if you're coming to Harry Potter Studios and you want a place to stay that's, you know, cheap and close to the studios, I would highly recommend this place. Obviously, I think we were upgraded, so I think the actual room that we got for £63 was probably a lot smaller and, you know, not as nice as this one. But the actual place is lovely. The, um, the guy on reception was really helpful. They also have a restaurant and they have a bar. And yeah, it looked really Christmassy as well. Yay! Tea and coffee making facilities. For complimentary replenishments, please contact reception. <gasps> oh, you're happy. All the tea and coffee. Free Wi-Fi. I like that the bathroom light goes off when you've not been in mm. there for a while. Also, the restaurant sells food, but also the bar sells hot food um, up until nine o'clock. So that's quite good because we're really full from Ed's diner. But if we fancy like getting a little bit of food, we can. Because we were like, we don't think we can manage a whole restaurant dinner. So yeah, we can go to the bar and we'll show you what the bar's like. So I was just lying on the bed here and then I think we noticed that you can pull up this blind. <laughs> Oh, I think Martin broke it. <laughs> and then you can see the person in the bath. <gasps> there we are, I saw you. Wow. We saw you. There, we saw you. Can you see us? <laughs> can you see us? <laughs> That's so funny. Sit in the bath. <laughs> That's so funny. Hey. Just just chilling in the bath. I can't get in here. <laughs> That's so funny. And <laughs> you can literally see the person. Hey. You could watch the TV. <laughs> I feel very relaxed. We're just kind of thinking what to do. Are you right? <gasps> what? Is it a hot tub? Let's have a look. It's got jets. Oh, it has. It's got jets there. No, oh, I'll have to fill it up though, to try it. <laughs> Maybe I have to try it later. Okay. But it looks like it's got jets. We'll try it. That's so funny. Yeah, you go out there. <laughs> so first things first. Ooh, a nice cup of tea. Oh. Try and do this one-handed. Oh, you need to get the blue there. So a week ago, we attempted to start watching all the Harry Potter films. <laughs> Did like a little Potterthon before we went to the studios, but we've only managed up to halfway through Order of the Phoenix so far, which I think is pretty good. I'm sorry, the <laughs> battery ran out. Um, but I think I got up to saying that we are up to halfway through Order of the Phoenix. So we still have half of Order of the Phoenix, then we've got half, up, half Blood Prince, and then we've got part one and part two of Deathly Hallows. That's the one. <laughs> so we brought our Blu-ray player, can't speak, Blu-ray player from home, um, but we don't, we've lost the controller because we, mm -hmm. we always play our Blu-rays on our PlayStation, um, but we do have an old Blu-ray player. Um, from our Crystal Palace flat. So we brought that with us, but we don't have the control. But luckily, the hotel's control seems to be working. Yeah, because it's got all the play buttons and stuff, yeah. and it's linked to the TV rather than the Blu-ray. And the Blu-ray is connected to the TV. So we are in luck. We can carry on our Potter Marathon. Oh. 
The thing is though, I, d I don't think we're going to be able to get all of the Harry Potters done, are we, before tomorrow? No, I don't think so. <laughs> Unless Not unless we stay up, stay all, up night. all night. Which, no. So, we're hoping to finish Order of the Phoenix tonight and then maybe tomorrow, if we're up early, we can watch Half-Blood Prince in bed. Then do the studios and then watch Deathly Hallows after the studios, which might be quite nice, like part one and part two, after, this, after we've seen the studios. I'm thinking the perfect way to watch Harry Potter would be inside of a... <laughs> A bubbling bath <laughs> with the jets on <laughs> you won't be able to hear it you'd have to have it so loud <laughs> or the subtitles on so yeah i'm not really sure what our plan of the evening is but i will quickly show you the things that we picked up in into watford we were <laughs> slightly disappointed it's not gonna take long. no it's literally two things we wanted harry potter jumpers to wear tomorrow but we couldn't find any. There was one Hufflepuff one in the women's section, but it wasn't like the knitted um, Hufflepuff one. It was just plain grey with the Hufflepuff logo on it, which was nice, but they didn't have a Ravenclaw one for um, Martin. So I just thought I'd leave that one because I wanted like matching ones to wear. And then I also wanted us to get Christmas pyjamas to wear on Christmas Day, but we didn't find any matching ones. So... Yeah, a bit disappointing, but it doesn't matter. We picked up something from the Disney store. It was what we showed in the vlog earlier. We actually went back because we just couldn't resist. Mm -hmm. And we got the Hercules video VHS cover notebook, which is just so cool. It was a toss up between the Hercules one and the Goofy movie, but we love both, but we thought it's so rare that you get Hercules merchandise and Hercules is my all-time favourite Disney film. Is it yours as well? Uh, One of yours, no, no, Toy Story. It's not my all-time overall favourite, but it is a very firm favourite. It's a firm, it's a Martin Bell firm favourite. <laughs> so yeah, we showed it to you in the shop, but it just has Hercules all over the cover and then on the back it's like the VHS tape so it has like a summary of the plot it's got like the running times and everything and then the first page is set up like it's a VHS and then the notebook so we think we're gonna write all our YouTube plans all our video ideas um, and also like Disney holiday plans inside um, oh look it's got Pegasus <laughs> inside so yeah, you got there. This is like the shortest haul ever, because this is the second thing. <laughs> um, I went into Accessorize and I got these clips, which are so pretty. Um, I wanted these over Christmas. Um, I think I'll probably wear them on my hair tomorrow as well, but I just wanted them to like pin back this side of my hair and have these clips in because um, I thought they were really Christmassy and I've seen quite a lot of people wearing um, like big silver clips in their hair and I just thought it looked really nice so I copied them. <laughs> yeah, so I just picked these up from Accessorize. They were quite expensive, they were £8 but you do get five clips and um, yeah, I thought they were really pretty. So that concludes our Into Watford haul. <laughs> so not as successful as we hoped but... It was still nice. We went to Ed's Diner, as you saw, and yeah, had a nice little shopping spree. We watched about half an hour more of Proper. Order of the Phoenix, and now we've got ready, and we're going to go to a nearby supermarket, grab ourselves some snacks so we can watch the rest of the film, and also grab a few breakfast things so we can have those in the morning before we go, because we didn't get breakfast. Um, it's an additional, I think, £12 per person if you want to uh, have breakfast, so we decided against that for this time. Yeah. So we'll grab some... Uh, Croissants. You some... can get a little porridge pot because they've got a um, kettle. It's Raven. The Raven about these porridge pots. Yeah, so you can have it in bed and watch more Harry Potter. <laughs> <laughs> I just put my little clips in. They're quite cute, aren't they? Mmm, very nice. Christmassy. For... Yeah, that's what I was about to say. Mm -hmm. Does Martin know where he's going? That's the question. Yeah, I've heard us to the front. Ah, you have. Well done. We're in proper Harry Potter mode, but we just said this bit looks a bit like Privet Drive. <laughs> 
It's my birthday. I'm in Morrison's. Oh, do you remember that? How many of you, if you're long time viewers, remember that? That was probably our fifth, maybe, vlog on the channel. Um, it's called it Martin's Broken Down or something. My boyfriend's, My boyfriend's car broke down yeah. or something like that. And if you go all the way back and watch that video, write in the comments. <laughs> <laughs> I'm in Morrison's. It's my birthday. We're doing well, guys. Although, still haven't found the porridge pot. <laughs> so we just went to Morrison's, picked up our goodies. I'll do a little Morrison's haul. <laughs> it might be slightly better than the Watford haul. <laughs> um, but we're just going to head into the bar, see what it's like, and maybe grab a drink. See if it's like the Great Hall. Yeah. I'm hoping it's Christmassy. It's through like these doors. Cute. <laughs> Morning room. Oh, and it's Christmassy. <laughs> oh, it's really Christmassy. Been searching for the bar, having a little explore. There's Christmas trees everywhere. Look at these. It's all cool. Look at that. Look at those decorations. Ooh. Sticked out. People are holding up the fireplace. <laughs> Just before you are there. Hold the actual wedding. Yeah, or like a conference room. <laughs> oh, these though, they're quite Hogwartsy, aren't they? Yeah. Right, let's find the bar. So we're back from our drink. Sorry, we couldn't film too much. There was like a huge group of um, people. I think they must have been on like a work conference thing so they were quite loud but they were also really close to us so I got a bit self-conscious mm -hmm. I was like I don't know it was a really small room and like I'm getting more confident with vlogging in public but when it's a small room and it's only you and like another person I just always get a bit like oh they're gonna look at me <laughs> uh, which is silly but I don't know if any of you vlog you might know the feeling anyway we're home we're home. Home. <laughs> We're back in our in room. With Harry Potter back I am. I feel very settled in this <laughs> hotel. I think it's because we've got like Harry Potter playing <laughs> and all our like belongings. I know, yeah. Have you seen this Doritos packet? I'm dreaming of a white and then it got crossed out. Doritos. I'm dreaming of a white. No, I'm dreaming of Doritos. Yeah. We're going to have our snacks, aren't we? I put them in the fridge. Oh, right. Yeah. I was wondering where the main course I was. was. Very domesticated. <laughs> put it all the way in the fridge, and I've got all our breakfast stuff ready to go. Look, our porridge pots and our croissants. And then we've just got a few, because we had that huge um, meal at Ed Diners. We just got a couple of wraps from Morrison to have as a little late night snack. <laughs> The bathroom just knew I was coming. The lights just turned on. We just finished watching Order of the Phoenix and actually after watching that one back, it's got so many one. great bits in like Dolores on bridge and Hagrid's. I haven't watched that one in ages. Really Proper. good. I think it, oh, has it just become a favourite? You can't decide your favourite till you've watched the oh, movie. I don't know. What, your favourite is, um... Well, it used to be Goblet of Fire. I thought you liked, um... Oh, I like the, um... Ugh. Prisoner of Azkaban. Yeah, Prisoner of Azkaban's a good one. That used to be your It's favorite. because I like Sirius, Sirius Black. Yeah, you like the ones that, yeah, Sirius and a lot. I don't know, we'll have to wait and see. But that, the reason, that film's so much better than I remembered. The reason I'm taking you into the bathroom <laughs> is because I'm going to try the, the bubbly bath. <gasps> the bubbly bath. It's getting there. You've got to fill it up quite far. But when it gets above this last vent here, 
That's when we're going to try the bubbles. Has Helena told you how good <laughs> porridge pots are yet? I've already showed them that I put the porridge pots here ready for the morning. <laughs> Martin keeps laughing at my porridge pots. I think it's a really good invention for on the go, not sponsored. <laughs> because you have the pot and then all you need is a spoon and hot boiling water. Yeah. And you literally fill it up to the line, that's your breakfast. Filling up nicely. This is going to be a bit of a um, anticlimax if it doesn't actually work. I'm not getting in it. I'm just gonna... <laughs> I know we're just testing the. Uh... Well, we're you're going to get in it if it no, works. I am going to get in. Yeah, it. that'll be that'll be that'll a waste, be a waste of, of water. water. Yeah. It's over the thing now, so you could try. The last time I had one of these baths was in Orlando. Oh yeah. In a. But well, that was a jacuzzi. Oh, it wasn't a villa. In our, um, no, no, in 2016. Oh, mm. It was like a jet bath and it was broken. It didn't work, did it? I didn't try it out till the end of the trip, but then I found out it was broken. <laughs> but we were in Orlando, so we were, we were busy um, at Disney, so we didn't mind. What if this isn't a button? So <laughs> just put it here. Go on. Oh my god! Look at how happy he is! <laughs> So that that's under the water. I think so. <laughs> <laughs> that's quite intense for a little bar. Uh, I just fill that up a little bar. <laughs> <laughs> Is this jet at the top here? It's like spraying up. I think it's got to be over the. Um... <laughs> that clip of you just like jumping back. Oh God. <laughs> okay, I can't really get it any fuller than this. Otherwise, when I get in, all the water's going to come out. Mm. That's that's as full as I can take it, right? Yeah, try now. Should I try? Go on. <laughs> that's, that's better. better. That's like a proper jacuzzi. Oh, it feels really nice. I love this place, dude. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. I'm hot. That was some. What would you call it? Like a jacuzzi bath. Jacuzzi bath, yeah. A lot of bubbles. Yeah, so a helmet. Dipped a whole shower gel in there. Thought that putting shower gel would just cause a few bubbles, but then when you put it on like the highest setting, <laughs> it just created a, a, a foam bath. <laughs> yeah. Couldn't see me. <laughs> so uh I'm trying to cool off now and we're gonna start watching the next Harry Potter and the next one is the Half Blood Prince. So we'll see if that tops Order of the Phoenix, because at the minute that's it's way up there for me. But uh, I'm really enjoying watching them all back. I am as well. I haven't done it in ages. Well, we always try. Helena's stretching over here. Oh yeah, I'm just stretching. Over here. <laughs> um, we always try. and We always get up to like goblet of fire normally. Yeah. And then we kind of it fizzles out, and we don't end up watching the rest. Yeah. So it's good because we're actually going to do it this time. But I think we'll leave this here. But then we're going to the vlog's not finishing. The next time you see us, though, it'll be the morning. <laughs> so we're going to start watching it. Night see you guys. See you in the next clip. <laughs> Morning guys. So we're checking out. We really loved it. Had right. such a good night's sleep. Did you? Yeah. I loved that bed. I wanted to take it. <laughs> it was huge. Looks even more like Privet Drive in the daylight. <laughs> oh, it's sunny. So we spent the morning watching <laughs> Harry Potter Half Blood Prince and we got up to what about 20 minutes before the end? Yeah. <laughs> so annoying. <laughs> um, but then we had to check out. So we thought we'd go for a little quick wander around the grounds and yeah show you what the hotel is like in daylight. It's a crisp morning. It is, it's a nice morning actually. So we're just going through the little gateway. Oh cute. It looks quite magical because of the frost. 
Imagine if you just got transported somewhere. <laughs> Buck beak. Oh, I didn't bow. This is cute. Very secret garden esque. Squirrel! <laughs> Squirrel! <laughs> Squirrel! <laughs> <laughs> So we've gone through the archway and it's led us into the forest but we don't know whether it's going to be a bit too muddy because it's cold today. <laughs> Change of plan. <laughs> Sensible budge. you got your trainers on. <laughs> I've got my boots on. And I've got to wear them all day. Yeah, I know, I know. It was the <laughs> sensible thing to do. So we'll have a wander around this way. Outside seating area, good during the summer. Must get used for the weddings as well, I think. People having drinks. We, um, we're very slowly starting to look at wedding venues, guys. So if you have any good wedding venues um, in the Surrey, Essex, Kent, London area, let us know. So there's another garden area. Yeah, because I think they'll have the they'll have the wedding inside in that room that we saw. Then oh, they'll come out here. Of, they've got an outside license. Oh, have they? I don't know. Oh. Do. Where would they hold that? I don't think they'd do it here. I reckon they'd do it over there. Yeah. So there is a restaurant here if you want to eat in the evening. It's called Gilbert's. Said like that. <laughs> Gilbert's. Gilbert's. <laughs> oh, is there a menu? Oh. It's a bit foggy. What I could read, it said that it was three courses for £28. So there's main house bedrooms, which I think we were originally meant to be in. And then there's the garden lodge bedrooms, which is what we ended up in. And we think they're newer. I think they're like a newer build. Yeah, this is... this That's is quite old, isn't it? This is a grade two listed building. Another day, another shopping centre, guys. <laughs> So we had to check out of the hotel at 11 and our Harry Potter isn't till 3 so we've got a bit of time to kill so we thought we would come to another shopping centre. To try and find the Primark. Have another little look in another Primark, get some food and then head to um, the studios. So we've come to Harrow, we've come to St Anne's shopping centre. Mm -hmm. Who knows? Have a little bit of an explore, maybe find some Harry Potter, Harry Potter jumpers. Hopefully. But we're just checking how far it is from here to Harry Potter so we know what, what time we have to leave here. What have you just spotted? Harry Potter jumper. <laughs> Go on then. <laughs> there it is. It looks like it's a Gryffindor though. I can't wear a Gryffindor. I'm a Hufflepuff. <laughs> I'm tempted to just be a Gryffindor for the day, but you that's have, blasphemous. You might have to be. I might have to be. We're back in the car. <laughs> Sorry guys, we couldn't film too much in that shopping centre because it was so busy, which yeah. is weird because it's like a Tuesday afternoon, but yeah, it was really busy with Christmas shoppers. But we weren't successful. No. I think I showed you the um, Harry Potter Gryffindor knitted tops from Primark, which we did really like, but I'm a Hufflepuff. I'm a Ravenclaw. And it just didn't feel right <laughs> to wear it. Even though I was very tempted to be an honorary Gryffindor for the day, I was like, no, I'm a Hufflepuff. I've got to stay. <laughs> I've got to stay didn't, strong. Didn't really fit because it was women's. It was a women's um, jumper. jumper, yeah. So we decided to not get it. Um, and yeah, we're just going to go in. Well, I'm just wearing normal clothes, and Martin has a goofy jumper on. Well, I'm going to take the goofy jumper off and yeah. show off because I've got a Harry Potter t shirt underneath. Yeah. Well, I'm going to judge how cold it is. Yeah, it's quite chilly. <laughs> but yeah, we are going to head over to the studios now. So that's going to be in the next vlog um, because it's going to be a pretty long one <laughs> because we're going to vlog our whole trip at Warner Brothers Studios. Um, so make sure you check that one out when it's up. But for now, thank you so much for watching, guys. And we will see you in the next video. Bye. Bye.